Welcome back to another video. Y'all you know what time it is. Make sure you smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Um, yeah, put us on post notifications so you won't miss another upload. We will be uploading every single day, not missing a day. So, yeah, pardon me if I'm whispering. I'm recording this late, late in the morning, slash night, or whatever you want to call it, whatever it is, 2 in the morning. Anyway, we're looking at Jaden Smith, Dreadlocks. This is pretty much his first picture, like that's when he first started. So he started off as a like high top, free form dreadlocks. That's exactly what he did. This is more like later on, three four years from that picture, you can see the length. He still has high top locks, but he also don't have a cut like a faded cut. Right here is a probably more so. I should have put this as the second picture. Um, this pretty much maybe a year and a half ish or two after that first picture where you see some growth and you see some crochet method going because he, I don't think he twisted with Joe. Um, he mainly did free form for the most part. If not, he probably like ripped them apart or he did the crochet method, which is pretty much Congo and some of them together or just letting them freely form by putting rubber bands or something or a hair tie in for too long. And they just started madding up and Congoing up together. This is more of a closer towards the middle part of his dreadlock journey because he indeed cut him off. Um, Y'all yeah, let me know in the comments, did Jaden Smith have one of the best dreadlocks in the game? But yeah, so right here he got it up in a high pony. So his hair is super duper long at that point. And right here you could fully see like it's freely formed. I think the thing about it is people get tired of their dreadlocks when they have them and they had it so for so long that once they cut them, they miss them. You know what I mean? Because it's they like a part of their identity for some for some reason, you know? But, yeah. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this photo. It's pretty cool. Freeform dreadlocks. Then right here, you can see a lot of Congo and a lot of maturing from that picture before because you could just see the texture of his locks. You could just see based off of his locks, like this little metal thingy that's in his hair, the hair jewelry, um, that's a Congo. It's probably like six or seven locks in that one Congo. And yeah, it's pretty cool because he got a pony and then boom, you can clearly see the free form locks right here. So he got a Congo to the left, got a Congo to the right. And I believe he definitely have a lot of different Congos in the crown area of his head um, due to the fact of no maintenance in a while. Y'all let me know who should I do next um, and rate this 1 through 10. Does Jaden Smith or did Jaden Smith have the best locks in the game?